hello guys welcome to today's video so in today's video we'll be retrieving our stored data from firebase so we'll be starting off from where we stopped on our last video so in our last video we we are able to store this data we are able to create two users so today we'll be retrieving this stored user so we're using our uh, Firebase admin SDK and Node.js. So this is basically um, a cloud function. So at the end of this video, we're able to achieve this. We're able to retrieve all users from the Firestore. We'll be able to also retrieve just one user by passing the user's ID. All right. So, um, we don't have much today. So let's get started. Let's see how this was achieved. And let's see how we can also achieve this. Okay, so um, this is, um, all, these are basically the two functions we'll be using to achieve one to get all users and to get a single user by passing the user's id so let's start with this oh, don't worry about the code um we don't need to start writing the code from um, scratch i will have to paste the github link right or you can go to my existing um, video my previous video and then um, get the link there because it's still the same it's a kind of a continuation from where we stop so this user ref here is the reference to our users collection so this was the first method we used okay so this method um will actually create the user so this very one will fetch all users so we are using this user reference this reference to our users collection with this gate method to re retrieve or to fetch all users then when we get the data we send it back to our users this is the actual data right and this is the route gate users okay now this is the second um, function to get user by id and this is the id kind of a parameter you have to pass to get the id the single user so we'll be using the same collection and we'll be using two methods now the where method is a query method and this get method so this is to actually to filter the particular data we want to return so by using this id field the id is from the data this is actually the, the id we are talking about okay so where id is equals to the the parameter will be uh, will be passing to get the that very user where the ID of the um, stored data matches with the one with the person. Then you, you, then you get the document. Right? Then you return the document to the users. This is the data will be returning. Okay. So if you pass an ID that doesn't match with any of the IDs in the database, it will return an empty data for you. So this is basically the two um, endpoints or APIs we need for these um, stuff to, or for us to achieve these um, get all users and get one user. Right. So that is basically how um, what we'll be doing today. So I'll be dropping the GitHub repository of this um, project in this same video. In the video's description section or you can also watch my previous video 
to understand where we are coming from and how we are able to get to this very stage thank you guys for your support um do well to subscribe to my video so you get notified when i drop more videos thank you so much